check out these adventures. Good morning, happy Monday, it's a new week, but it is President's Day, so no school, no work for the Bevos. And I'm looking around the house, is a little destroyed, which means we had a good weekend. Make sure you go back and watch that vlog. But I am up starting breakfast because I have the time to actually fry up some bacon, make some eggs. That's a good start to our President's Day. But we also have to be adults today and we need to do our taxes. That is definitely on the calendar. You always gotta set time aside to get those done. Do your taxes. Mason, I think, is still sleeping, so that's awesome. Wish I was still sleeping. Although I did sleep in, I think, to like 7.30. The alarm did go off at, I think, around 6.30, which is the time I normally get up to get Mason off to school. But I turned it off and went back to bed, so that was good. But yeah, I'm gonna start this breakfast, and then we need to get to our day and get our taxes done. You ready for that, Jack? You ready for a day off? I'm ready for a day off. Of doing yeah. taxes? You had me at bacon, you lost me in taxes. Sorry about that. <laughs> we have to be adults today. What do I say? Like 24 hours later, 10 hours later. What is the SpongeBob thing? <laughs> A long time later. SpongeBob is four hours later. Taxes are done. We did our part, sent off. So now we just wait and see. Hopefully we did everything right. Probably not. Probably not, we never do. But uh, Mason's been hanging out with his friend over his friend's house, so lucky him, while we were sitting here crunching numbers, he's hanging out. Must be nice to be a kid. Mm -hmm. But um, Jack and I are actually about ready to head out. We're going to do a quick Sam's Club uh, run. But I was just emptying my purse because we were at Sierra's Volleyball Tournament yesterday at the Arizona Cardinal Stadium. When I forgot that I got, should I show them? Sure. Can I open it? I got something for myself. Ooh. I got new earrings. See if I can get them to focus. There they are. Little dangly baseballs. So cute. So I'll have to rock those Mason's next um, baseball tournament. But we're headed off to Sam's Club. The damage was done. Double fisting drinks. <laughs> So we, much I can't even put my sunglasses on. We were nice parents and got Mason an icy. Yes. Aw. Hopefully he appreciates us. Got to load these up into the, into the house to earn it. <laughs> well, we're back from Sam's Club and I have it laid out and I'm like, why did we spend $200? How did we spend $200? But I think maybe the clothing items? I'm not really for sure how this all added up to $200. I kind of almost want to <laughs> check my receipt because it doesn't really make sense to me. Like how did all this add up to two hundred dollars, Jack? I have no idea. Hmm. But um, Mason should be home anytime from his friend's house, and I think the boys are gonna head out to do some hitting. Good morning. We are trying to wake up after a nice three-day weekend. It is Tuesday. Back to school for Mason. Good news is a, it's a game day, so I know he's excited for that. You guys, this is last week of basketball games. I feel like the basketball season went by so fast. But he has two games left this week, and then we'll go hopefully into playoffs. I think everybody makes the playoffs. At least that's how baseball worked. So he should at least have another game. And then depending how he does in playoffs, I'm assuming next week sometime, but we'll have to get the schedule on that. But yeah, it's game day, and with the three-day week, it means only four days of school this week. He's got this, I think. It's kind of hard to get him out of bed this morning. But I'm gonna get him some breakfast. I'm gonna drink some coffee. I'm gonna try to get to the gym and get a good workout in and start our week. At least it's a short week. Good morning. Kids over here watching Dude Perfect before school. You ready to go back to school? No. Are you gonna wear your basketball jersey today? Mm -hmm. I think it's hanging up in the laundry room. Yeah. Um, today's gonna be a crazy day. You got school, you got a school basketball game, and then after that, I think we're gonna try to get you the baseball for bullpens and hitting today. Can you handle all that? And eventually we'll be back home to sleep. <laughs> Is that interesting over there? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Is that your favorite YouTuber? I don't know. Mm. People always ask. I never have an answer. That's why, because <laughs> he doesn't know either. All right, we'll have a good week. It's just a short week, okay? 
Just a little update, I have picked up Mason from school and we realized that he is not going to be able to make it to baseball practice. Like earlier today I said that he was going to go to his school basketball game and we were going to rush him over to um, baseball practice, but apparently the coach that schedules all of our practices got the times wrong. So practice starts right when Mason's um, basketball game starts. So it'd be no point in driving all the way over there for like 10 minutes of practice. So bless his heart, I couldn't find him. And then I heard something. He is currently in the garage. He says he wants to at least get through a bucket of balls because tonight's practice was hitting and bullpens. So he wants to get some tea work in since he knows that he's not going to be able to go to baseball practice. And I didn't tell him to go out there. Jack didn't tell him to go out there. In fact, Jack's not even home. Jack's currently at the dentist um, getting his teeth cleaned. So he's out there and he has about, I don't know, 30 more minutes until I have to get him off to his basketball game. So super proud of the kid. He definitely works hard. Hopefully it all pays off for him. But, um, and with all of that, I don't have dinner plans tonight because I thought we were going to be literally going from school basketball game to ba baseball practice. And I was like, we'll just have to do fast food like literally like nine o'clock tonight. But now we're gonna have this basketball game and come home and I have no dinner. So I don't know, we're probably gonna have to still go out to eat because I, I don't even think that I can even I haven't been in the store. I was at Walmart today. I probably could have picked something up, but I was picking up other stuff like, you know, shampoo, that kind of stuff, but oh well, I don't know. So I'll talk to Jack tonight when he gets home and see if the boys maybe want to go out to dinner. But right now, Mason needs to finish hitting and then we're off to basketball. Well, looks to be about a bucket. Couple more swings. Yeah, I told you, it's about a bucket. And one. The rebound, go up. Good shot. The rebound. Holy moly, I can't believe I'm eating this, but I am. <laughs> I'm gonna barbecue. Mason says we always go here when we're losers. Because it makes you feel like a winner. It's so good. <laughs> So the it's boys. It's not a knock against the place. We no, love the place. no, no, no. Cheers to South when we come back. The boys just lost by one point. Not even a bucket, but one point. Look at Mason, look at my food. Yeah, I know. Mom's eating that. Yeah. I don't know. I'm already it's, full though, and I haven't even. Oh, well, maybe like half. It's a baked potato with chili on top. Uh -huh. Okay. Good it's luck. pretty good. Thanks, bud. Thank you. <laughs> Happy Wednesday, everyone. I'm so confused. Today feels like Tuesday, but with the holiday, nope, it's Wednesday already, which is awesome because we're halfway through the week. And you guys, I did a little shopping today. Sorry, Jack. And I blame, I blame the truck on this because instead of going to the gym this morning, the truck was due for emissions. First of all, can you believe our truck is five years old? Here's what I want you guys to do. Leave a comment down below if you have been following us for five years because we vlogged when we got that truck. We turned in the red truck, got the, uh, the Nissan. It was kind of a sad day to let the red truck go, but Jack and I, we keep our vehicles. We're not people that like trade out our vehicles constantly. So it's very normal for us to have vehicles for a long time. And the red truck, I wanna say we had it probably for around five years when we got rid of it. 
to get the new truck. Not so new anymore, it's five years. But anyways, long story short, it needed emissions today so I can renew the tags. So instead of going to the gym, I was like, I'm going to get there as soon as they, as soon as they open. So hopefully I beat the crowd, which I did. I didn't have to wait too long. Truck passed the mission so I can get the tags renewed. And then it was a snowball effect after that. I went to Ross, then I went to Target, and then I did need to go to Trader Joe's because I wanted to get some stuff to make for dinner tonight and tomorrow, and I just haven't been in a while, so needed some stuff, but eeks, oops, kind of had a shopping day. So I think what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go through the um, Trader Joe's stuff, and a lot of the stuff you guys have already seen, it's our staple stuff that we get all the time, but I did get a couple of new items, so maybe I will show you guys what I got. All right, so here's everything out of it. Bags, I'm sure some of the stuff you recognize we've had before. This guy's new stuff. This is for, um, let's see, Dennis Knight, Dennis Marmite, Dennis Marmite. But anyways, new stuff. Miss Marmite gets almond butter from Sam's Club. She was running well, so why not? I was there. Try this one. See if you like it. Gluten-free, instant oatmeal, unsweetened. I figured I can put fresh fruits. Um, maybe a little brown sugar, just kind of sweeten it up myself. Give that a try. Mason is an iced tea drinker. Haven't tried Trader Joe's sweet tea yet. Got a big old jug. It's gonna love me for that. Feel free to go. I've heard good things about their ketchup. Haven't had it yet. We were running so we haven't got Trader Joe's ketchup. Let's see. Haven't tried this yet. Um, haven't tried these yet. Uh, I'm missing something on these because it's made with almond butter. They're gluten free. Um, these are Minecraft. They're new. At least I think they're new. They're just back for the season. But they got me. I was literally about ready to take. And they jumped out. Into my cart. Literally. No, not really. But. Um, I got some cereal for me. And I think everything else you guys have seen before. These we got for the first time last call. And they were so good. I had to get another bag of those. But some of this stuff is just like for dinners for the next couple of days. I don't know the boys. Love these last time, so I got them. Those again. They're all that. Basically, they're staple stuff, but um, I think I've gotten those before. But, and then, yeah. So that's that. And this stuff over here, I want to redo the downstairs bathroom. So I bought some stuff. I have receipts if I don't like it. So I was telling myself, you can always return it, but it's time to upgrade and change. I'm just sick of the stuff. That stuff's been in the bathroom forever. So time to upgrade it. If I like it, we'll see. If not, I'll return it. Um, but that's the plans. I'm going to work on that. I'll put away Trader Joe's Hall stuff. And then Mason, let's see, he has basketball practice um, for school. And then I think Jack's gonna pick him up and take him straight out to hit because like we said earlier in the week, he's not gonna be able to get to any baseball um, practice this week because of his basketball schedule. So he's gonna have to practice on his own and that's what they plan on doing. But right now, I need to get this put away. Because you guys, it's like 80 degrees today in Phoenix. Oh my gosh, I'm so ready to sit and watch a spring training game. I'm so excited. How was school? Good. How was basketball practice? Good. You guys ready for another big game tomorrow? We'll see. Uh, it's going to be a good one. But we are about ready to head out to get some hitting in for Mason and I'm gonna tag along and help with uh, gathering up all the baseballs that he hits because it's five o'clock and we're losing sunlight so hopefully I can help out. At least that's the plans. But I made the boys snacks. Snack, snack a -roo. There's the snacks. Mason wanted a pretzel. That's some leftover for, uh, orange chicken from dinner the other night. The stuff we need to donate, you guys. I think, I think that the oh. bathroom's gonna work out. Ooh, that's right, I left all the tags on and kept all the receipts just in case I didn't like it. But there's the rug. New toilet paper holder. This is new. And a new trash can. And I told Jack I saw something that I liked. We need to put stuff, we used to have stuff up on the walls, but I didn't like it. So it's a start, and it's blurry. But there's the bathroom, a little bit better. You guys ready? Is it hot? It's hot. <laughs> and I am gonna make dinner, so hopefully don't get too full. I'll try not to. It's just a little snack. This is just so I don't pass out. Okay. It's a nice bag you got there, Mason. Links down below if you guys are ready to get your plate crate. And let's see that shirt. Nice. He rocked that at school today and basketball practice. It happens.
are back from hitting and I've got dinner on the stove going, some jambalaya. It's getting going there. But Mason had a package arrive for him and I think we are gonna go ahead and open it. Way to put in some work, Mason. Straight from basketball, hitting, the time has come. Open it. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Taco Taco. Hit Moss. So these aren't even out yet. They aren't? They nope. drop on Tuesday. So you guys are seeing this vlog on, on Saturday. Saturday. So pre-order if you can. Use our link down below. Use the promo code BEVOS for 15% off your total order. And like I said, these are dropping on Tuesday. So get these now because I'm sure they will go quickly. <laughs> Just so. like their hoodies that they have. Yeah, the, shorts the baseball season those, ones. Yeah, yeah those, those are awesome here, too. gone, came back. They might be gone already, but yes, this is awesome. <laughs> but yeah, make sure you guys get yours. They drop on Tuesday. Hit moss. So you can be rocking these shortly. How much to give me one of these? That is pretty awesome. Yes. And this kid loves his Taco Bell. Yes, and shout out to Josh. Thank you, <laughs> Baseball Lifestyle 101, for hooking us up. But yeah, so awesome. Get your own today or Tuesday. The apple taco, hitmas. And now we eat dinner. Okay. It's not Taco Bell though. Sorry guys. I'm training. No, oh, I'm bad. It is finally time to get that mop cut. It's not really that long. Yeah, it is. So long. Okay, but look You're at You're gonna grow it out like Harper. Bryce Harper? <laughs> no. I wouldn't grow it that long. It's not even like it's that long. He likes it long, guys. The sides are just long. All right, let's head in. What do you think? Good. good. Obviously. Yeah. Feel fresh. Mm. Yeah. Looks good. This kid's hungry. He does have a basketball game we have to get to, though. Dinner will be after your game. <laughs> Say good luck. Good luck. Give me that. Get it! One more, one more. Congratulations, Mr. Mason. Thank you. They just got the dub. It's a great game to watch. He played outstanding. This whole team played really good. Yeah. Proud of them. This this technically was the last game of the season. The regular season. Now we go into playoffs. And Dude. Mason said at the end when coach was talking to them, it sounds like they're going to, because of the record, get a bye. 
So we have a few days off and then basketball will be back at it towards the middle of next week. But schedule isn't out completely yet, so we're just going off of what Coach said. But super proud of the boys to get the bye. That's awesome. And no practice. He's giving you tomorrow off. No practice. What? Get a Friday night off? Well, probably going to hit with Dad, but. What? All right, boys are hungry. Take Friday night off. We'll see. We'll see. We're supposed to have a baseball weekend. But it's not looking good, because why? Rain, rain, go away. <sighs> it, might, it might look cloudy out today. Like I know. We'll, start we'll see, we'll see. But I put dinner, of course, you guys, in the crock pot. Today is going to be, it's a uh, chicken pot pie. I know it looks a little weird, but the, you get the, the pie part by putting a biscuit on top. So the boys will put biscuit on top of their pot pie. You guys ready? Bon appetit, boys. It's ready. Two on TV. What is it? Oh, the Sandlot. Best movie ever. Happy Friday, everyone. Ah, my hair's a little messy. It's beautiful out. I just picked Mason up from school, had the windows down. It's so nice out. But you guys, we are on weather watch, rain watch. We're supposed to be playing baseball this weekend, but it's supposed to rain. How was your day? Good. We're supposed to end the vlog right now because this vlog is over 20 minutes long, so Dad said, end it. So that's what we're gonna do. He's headed off to hitting tonight with Jack. I'm gonna sit on the couch and enjoy my Friday night. Hopefully we're playing baseball this weekend. Fingers crossed. Probably. As always, thanks for watching. We will see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and comment in the comment section. And don't check the uh, Instagram for more simple adventures. And that's why we go adventures. And don't don't press probably, don't for, don't forget to press the bell down below so you get notified when we post the next video. And don't check out next time's adventures.